Yeah, look, we, over the course of this tournament, have done some things right, but it doesn't feel like we've nailed it yet. So I guess this last game is an opportunity for us to show in our performance what we are capable of. And we'd really, really like to show everybody that. That was a massive opportunity for me. Uh, it's been a, a long time coming. I've been a part of this group for a number of years now. It was a pretty exciting time. I was, it's something I feel I didn't know how it was gonna go. Uh, it was definitely in a position I, I wasn't expecting, um, but really, really enjoyed it. Um, not the result that we, we would have wanted, um, but hopefully we can keep building. Yeah, so Watsonians reintroduced my love of rugby. So I'd taken a couple of years away from rugby because I hadn't found the balance of life in rugby possible. But they gave me a supportive group of people and a family to reignite that passion for the game and a community that I could come in and, and have a network of people around me. And the, the rugby was really fun. And you know, the group is, is social and fantastic. And, I really wouldn't recommend anybody go to a different club in Scotland, but um, you know everybody's experience is different. But they really, really helped me make this my home. Yeah, look, it's twofold, isn't it? Like one, it's always exciting to be a part of a World Cup. You know, we're the first Scottish women's team to go in, in 12 years, so it's a, it's a big moment for this team, and to go and represent Scotland is is a massive honour. On the other side of it, it's going to be the first time that my <laughs> family will be able to see me play and they wouldn't be able to travel um, overseas so they're going to be able to get to see some test match rugby that I'm hopefully involved in selection dependent uh, so it's it's going to be a really nice time to spend with family but also a massive opportunity uh, to perform at a World Cup.